app repository of docker update the packages then install the docker ce community edition something is given in public key cannot be verified okay update the packages install the docker community edition Next, give the user permission to the docker user. Next, give the ch mode to six to docker socket. Okay, let's say make a directory for Node.js docker. So, in that, we will create a sample Node.js applications. So, make let's make a directory Node.js docker. navigate to newly created directory next create a one sample file json this this json will give the developer okay so for now we are creating the one sample application node.js applications so we'll create a package.json copy the sample code JSON Docker. Next, create one more server dot JS. Copy the sample code. So here, constant port it will run on port three thousand. You can give the different ports, and it's accessible from the all the IPs and the message is a hello world. Okay, we are creating the hello world Node.js applications. Next, create a one more Docker ignore file. Okay, for Node.js. So here we are using the this is a docker file instruction okay from the instruction of docker file so any docker file will start from the for, from the instruction from node 12 version switch to the work, the work directory user src app then copy the 
current package draw json into this docker image then install the npm packages for node then copy the source directory to the destination and docker image expose 3000 port cmd node run the server.js inside a docker image okay. let's save this docker file so we have made a directory node.js docker to, to list of the hidden file ls a so we have created docker ignore docker file package.json server.js these two file will give the developer so just we have to focus on the docker ignore and docker file okay so we have created docker file the node.js and version we are using the node 12 which is the current stable version okay. then build the docker image So command is sudo let's create a uh, one ECI registry in AWS. So log into AWS, click on services, search elastic container registry okay then click on get started then give the name the post name so here we are giving the node.js docker okay then keep the one the default one then create a repository so we have created the ECI repository for the node.js docker okay click on newly created repository then you will get click on view push commands so you will get the how to build the docker image all these things you will the commands so click on view push commands so these are the instruction as per you are using the mac os linux you are using the windows os so we are using the linux os so these are the instructions first you have to log in that to push the docker image from your local system out from kubernetes to aws elastic container registry so first you have to log in then build the docker image so command is docker build hyphen t means tag node.js docker and source path so let's run this command click on the copy run the command so it will create the docker image from the docker file for the node.js application it's building the docker image Hello. Hello. Yes. So here, Docker build hyphen t no JS Docker. You have to give in Docker file, right? No. This is for this command is for the building the Docker image from the yes. file. Yes. Yes. Yes, sir. From that file, we have to build image. Yes. Right? Then yes. why you given the node JS Docker? It's a folder name, right? No, no, it is a tag name. You can give the Node.js latest one, anything. So I have dot, not confusing. I have given Node.js Docker. You can give, is it, is it, this is a tag. You can give anything. You can give the my Node.js I have, anything, as you wish. So I have given the, this name. This is not folder. So for confusing, I mean, I have created the same name. Okay. So our docker images is built
the next tag my output Let's check image. So to check the Docker images is built or not. So command is Docker images. So we have created the Docker images. Name is Node.js image. So if I am given the folder name is same. So don't confuse it. So here name is Node.js Docker. You can give any of the name. So, okay. Okay. Okay, so let's run Docker image uh, on locally, then push to the Docker ECL. So, so we have to first. So you will get idea that it is running or not, and any any problem within Docker images. So let's first run on a, your local, then push to the Docker AWS ECL. Okay, so command is Docker run hyphen p bind the port. So I am binding the port same port okay, 3000 to the outside and my image name is node.js docker okay so image is running so let's verify on browser on the management node so we have the kubernetes cluster click on the ip on browser we have exported the port 3000 so this is 3000 in node js default port Hello world. So Node.js image is running. So let's push to the AWS ECR. Check the Docker is running or not. Command is Docker. Yes. So let's stop Docker from here. So command is sudo Docker stop and container ID. Okay, it's stopping the Docker container. Okay, continue stop. So let's push the Docker image to the AWS ECR. Let's verify Docker image name. Docker images. So click on ECR. So click on your repo. Then click on view push commands. So we have build the docker image then after the tag your image so this is compulsory to tag your image so you can identify which is the image what tag i have given so docker tag node yes let us this is default tag i am giving this is my registry elastic content registry and it will save the my image using the node js docker colon latest okay copy this command run on kubernetes okay we have tagged docker image so then first log into the aws account okay, from kubernetes log into the kubernetes log into the aws using the aws cli Your 
thing is recorded. Then push to the Docker image to the ECR. Okay, we have created the ECR. Okay, uh, we have installed. So we have to push the Docker images from the AWS CLI. So we have installed already CLI on Kubernetes. Then let's configure AWS account on Kubernetes. So command is AWS configure. Give the access key ID. Okay, that is also I have configured. This is my access key ID. Then secret key. Okay, region is AP South. Mumbai location enter here so we have configure AWS account using AWS CLI then log into the that ECR okay so command is dollar AWS ECR get login so here using ago command we have logged into the aws account then we have to again log in we have to the acr aws ecr get login no include mail region ap south one run this command so login is succeeded okay. then push the docker image go to your aws account and to push the docker image command is this docker push my ecr name and my image name copy this command ok image is pushing to the aws ecr Let's wait till complete. So image is pushed from Kubernetes to AWS ECR. Okay. Let the screen. So go to the AWS. Then click on the refresh. So we have pushed the Docker image. Image tag is latest one. Okay. Click on the first team. If it was showing the blank, so size is one three fifty MB. Okay, so if if you want to import in Kubernetes, you have to copy this 